I think you target, um, uh, I think it's about education from, early, from an early yeah. age. So informing young children on what equality and diversity means. That like it's not just a buzzword. Uh, and, it, and the impact of being sexist and homophobic um, and ableist uh. and transphobic, what, what the impact that has on other people. Um, so I think, yeah, it's about sort of education and, um, and yeah, probably working with, like, which you're looking to do now, working with university, colleges, schools, and stuff like that to, to access people Excellent. to be able to do it. So. I think teaching um, students as well, I don't think people realise sometimes actually what they can say is racist or sexist. I don't think they realise all the time. Like to them it just is a bit of a joke and actually they don't so education around actually. So teach people about unacceptable. Yeah. But again that has to come from an early age because if you're brought up around it, I suppose it just becomes second nature to you and you don't realise. Campaigns like, did you ever see that video? They did. Um, our community officer showed me it on, it was around um, LGBT. Right. And they went round with a video camera and well, asked people, it was in America, um, do you think people are born gay or choose to be gay? And everyone was like, oh, they choose to be, they choose to be. And then the guy was like, all right, okay, when did you choose to be straight? And all of them wow. were just like, oh, well, we didn't choose. And he was like, well, that's and it was really good, it was really powerful, it was really yeah. good. That sounds really good actually. If you just YouTube it, just um, when did you choose to be gay and it should come up. Or when did you choose to be straight. I showed you that video, didn't I? The when did you choose to be straight video. Is it? Really? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Um, you guys should come down to our campus. Yeah. Like, we'd be more than happy to have you down if you wanted to. This is the last day of the... Oh, is and it? we were so lucky to be invited yeah. to come. Um, we've been doing further education colleges mainly, but we 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 felt that this was a good opportunity yeah. that couldn't be missed really because you can be a stu in the student union whether you're from a further education college or yeah. a university yeah. or or in an apprenticeship because yeah. we've got some apprentices yeah. here today as well. So we're hoping to get right across the board. What uni are you at? Uh, Manchester Metropolitan. All right. Yeah. So if you, if you do do this again and you get the opportunity, then yeah, definitely come down. Because um, we've got massive campus, like 37,000 students. Wow. Yeah, um, and we've got a, an outlying campus as well, which is in Cheshire. Yeah. Um, and they do a lot of events with local school children, and school children come onto campus and stuff. So if you can work around when kid, them kids are coming on, on, on campus as well, it's just something to, to, to actually talk to them about as well, which would be good. Um, why don't you put your in is it in, 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 I've said I'm just putting on here. We've got an invite from you, but what university? Uh, Manchester Metropolitan. Um, I suppose um, information. Um, because I, I, I'm, I'm not gonna, I'm not, I'm not gonna say that I'm a, an expert in any of them issues in particular. Um, so I think information and resources um, to be able to work with students um, to tackle sort of specific topics like this. Um, yeah, I think that, that's probably the main thing is, 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 is for me to be able to, to, to gain more knowledge in these areas in order to help. And maybe things like looking at best practice as well from maybe other um, places where you've worked or things you've come across, we would be able to use this um, as examples to inform my work as well, which is always good. So I always look at best practice from across the sector and things like that. So I picked up some good stuff from two colleges that I've been to, because Katina's been to different colleges than me. But certainly where I was yesterday, was, it seems so long ago, I went to Dinnington, which is... Um, a college in South Yorkshire and they were really good. They had a mock, what I found really interesting. That needs to go on one of the tunes, actually. That's that one. Um, and they've got a mock aeroplane and what they've done is 
as part of the as part of the curriculum and as part of their roles, the lecturers have to do one equality and diversity impact event a year. And so the business studies, the computer that that um, course, they've done all the research around fair trade and then they've given the information to the to another department, I can't remember how they did it, to another department that they then had to do an in on board magazine as a competition, and so someone won that and that was used. Then they did the boarding passes and then they had all fair, fair trade food on yeah, the aeroplane. Awesome. It was amazing because it wasn't done as this is us teaching you how to be. Yeah, it has to be engaging. Yeah, yeah. 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 It, to, yeah. And it, it was just amazing. They probably didn't feel like they yeah. actually yeah. taught about well, equality and diversity. I thought That's, that was yeah. really positive. And then another college I went to, they just talked about how they everything included a celebration of equality and diversity. So any, they had an E&D calendar and every week there was something going on. And, and from a faith point of view, it wasn't always about the chaplain was the person who invited us to go. Yeah. He wasn't talking all the time about religion, he was talking about inclusion. And that's yeah. what it's all yeah. about, isn't it? It's not about how do we get rid of it, it's how do we embrace it. Really. Get like a president role on there. Yeah. Um, I know, but you know, it's a long way to go. Yeah, for no, it. no, but that would be good. Yeah, yeah so I'll oh, definitely. Um, if you take that, scan the QR code into your um, smartphone, you'll find out what it was all about. Yeah. And feel free to email or whatever, yeah. or send other people to us. Yeah, we'll eat it, we'll do. Good luck. Yeah.